This is a good morning to everybody at home. Good morning. Hi, guys. Okay, so we'll stand toes apart, heels together. Take your feet, push them down through the floor. Take the crown of your head and reach it tall through the ceiling. Inner thighs tight, quads are on, glutes bolted together. Back X is on, front X is on, and squeeze the spine. So really feel that scapula to opposite hip pocket and scapula down to opposite hip pocket. Take everything tight, bring the hands up, and let's just flex into our armpits for four. Release, kind of like you have um, a debit card with your armpit or a clutch purse. And one more. Good, balancing, take your hands out in front of you. Just watch what's behind you. You're gonna take it over into a standing plank. Trying to get the body parallel to the floor. <clears throat> Hold here for a count of four, being focused and fierce. Three, two, one. Awesome, you guys, and bring it up. That was a first. Inhale here, I love that. Exhale, take it over. Good, hold, breathing, count of four, three, good, two, one, and bring it up. We're gonna do some release of the neck and the lower back. So I'm gonna actually have you take your bars and sit them flat. So we're gonna sit right here. So we'll just go that way. You can sit here. <laughs> will keep us on track, we'll know. Okay, so take your right hand on the edge, two finger pressure, and just open up the side of the neck. Huge stretch, even a little deeper. Keeping it there, you're just gonna tilt your chin down. Yeah, if backs are hurting, usually necks are tight. Now, keeping it low, take your chin to the ceiling. And still that two finger pressure, you're gonna feel the front of that neck. You're gonna take it over to the other side, kind of let it rest in the center position. Readjust, feel it down the shoulders, and then take it over. Take your fingertips, put them underneath the left side of the machine. Take it over, just stretching. And then chin down. Good, and just feel that whole back side of the neck. And then chin up to the ceiling, opening up the front of the neck. Good, and bring it down. From there, just let it relax down the shoulders. And we're gonna take our machine and set it up with two red springs and take everything else off. And we'll put the bar in middle. Everything else. There you go. And then you're gonna be sitting on your feet. So your toes are curled under you, sitting on your feet, feet against the shoulder rest. We're gonna open up the fascia of our feet. Yeah, let's just stretch. Just take the weekend off of you. So stretching out the feet by just sitting back on them. And you'll feel that fascia open up, but Kathy, if it's too much, if it's okay. It's like that from when your, your calf comes down into the Achilles tendon and it goes right through here. It's called the plantar fascia. And it comes all the way down and through the arch. And you'll start feeling that open up. If you've got super flexible feet, you won't feel it. But Kathy's going to be feeling this this morning. And then from there, we're going to keep bring it up, get into the abs, shoulders are down, pull tail between the legs, rib cage back, push the knees, yeah, open it up. And as you bring it in, so you're just going to keep the knees down, just bring it back in, just push the carriage out. And as you bring the knees in, feel about opening the thoracic spine. Yes. And <laughs> she feeling, do you feel a stretch when you come in? A stretch where? Right through here. Right. I feel pain in my knees. <laughs> oh, um, come, come up off your knees for a second and set them back down. Like readjust them and then bring them back down. As soon as I start moving, I just start stretching. I decided to strip before. Hey, we all go look at if you the memo want. here. That is all variations. I got this. Yeah. <laughs> What's that? Yes. 
Yeah, yeah JC I mean, Penney's. I've had my tattoos at Walmart. Has some good ones. It's been my favorite out of 20 years of finding them. Okay. <laughs> it's in my backyard. I'll go over there. <laughs> From there, we're going to go flat back and do the same thing. So instead of going round back, take your tailbone, lift it, get everything flat, rib cage and shoulders down, press out, pull in. And you're trying to find your abs. Yeah, now go flatter. Okay, so now. Yes. I was trying to do the first one. You can do whichever one feels better. How many are we doing? Tens. <laughs> Add five on. She starts like right away. Not so all. The good student, right? <laughs> so don't be fooled. <laughs> all, um, let's actually stay with the two reds, and we're gonna go right into leg springs. So we're gonna lay down, go feet in the long straps. I feel like this is a good birth, giving birth contraction. Yes. Uh, next time, if I get pregnant again, I'm gonna come here. Do <laughs> come here. Over here, here in my doula. How is your 16 month old feeling? Okay. I didn't know if she's he or she. Aww. Okay, hang in a hamstring stretch. Huge stretch. And think about pressing that tailbone down. So we got the feet. There we now get the calves and hamstrings. Inner thighs, legs go out to the side. Good. And take your grape in your lower back and make it more into a plum. Perfect. Now, instead of the small, tight circles we do, I want you to do big circles, so huge circles. But the, the thing that you can do here is to watch your hips so they don't wobble. So big, huge hip openers, but the trick is not to let the hips move. <laughs> you guys are very, you're very coordinated. Thank you. <laughs> now reverse it. We'll see if we can keep the same synch synchronicity going on here. <laughs> and go a med <laughs> go a medial ro uh, rotation. So turn all the way in. Yes, that's tomorrow. The walkovers and on the trapeze. Down my goal list. A walkover. <laughs> Two minute planks, yeah, for bone density. Oh yeah, side plank. Bring it down to home. We're gonna turn, zip, and wrap. Point the toes. Good. From there, and then come to like right below. Right there's your home. So never lower than home. Okay, from there we're gonna do frogs, straight up. Keeping the tailbone down, keep the heels together, bend down. Perfect, out to the side, but don't let the carriage move. Down and around and point. Good, pull straight up and bend down. Out to the side, down and around without the hips moving. Pull up through the abs. Good, draw down, keeping the glutes on. Press out, last one. Draw down to home and hold. Reverse it. Now, don't swing the carriage. I want you to take it out and control up through the abs. Perfect. Keep your knees there and just bend the heels together. Press straight up. Use the glutes and draw down into home. Good. Out to the side and up. Total control. Bend in. Press straight up. Use the glutes. Draw down. You like it? Out to the side. Bend in. Press straight up. Use the glutes and draw down. We'll do one more. Chin floats. Long necks. Out to the side. Throat is open. Good. Bend the heels in. Press straight up. Use the glutes and draw down. Tap the heels for three. So it's one, two, three. Squeeze tight. Pull up. And quick fire, squeeze and pull down. 
one, two, three, and up, one, two, three, and down. Now, what you're doing here is trying to activate those inner thighs in a quick fire and on a squeezing down and squeezing up. The more that we work our inner thighs on a quick fire, the better bounce we have when we hit our 80s and 90s. So today you might be like, I don't really feel this. Okay. Good. <laughs> Last one, hold here. Good. And now just small tight circles. So it's just about smoothness of the hips, the legs moving at the same exact time. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. It's working then. This is good. You guys will have great balance the rest of the day. All right, we kind of started with good balance on our planks. All three of you guys, great balance. Yeah, started off on the perfect, like, perfect Monday. Hold here, go a medial rotation, and go the opposite way for five. Watch those hips, don't let them move at all. Keep the same gap in your lower back. Yeah, it's like there's a grape right at your belt loop. That natural curve underneath the back. <laughs> what was that? I said this one feels awkward. Yeah, the, the, <laughs> here, I'll give you a really awkward one. Press out in the home with a medial rotation. Good, you're gonna bend your knees in with the medial rotation and press out. Oh, a medial rotation, bend in. Yeah, keeping those hips equal. I won't make you do this in public, though. I'm the opposite, eight of these. So I turn in like this to open up my lower back, and my sacrum because I walk with my toes out. And in, no, action equestrian. I should have been a dancer, but I had a lot of fun with horses. Okay, so from there, really reach those toes as far as you can, and bring them up in the home if you can, hold there. And I want you, without your feet moving, imagine I'm pushing you around, you're trying to hold your core still. Drop your headrest flat, but the whole time I'm pushing on you. There's a little block of wood, and you just flick it out. There you go. Okay, we're gonna do a short spine prep to open up the lower back, and then we're gonna do what's called short spine. So legs go up, tailbone stays down. Keeping the tailbone down, I want you to sink deeper into your stretch for three, in those hamstrings. Sink deeper for two, sink deeper for one. Bend the knees like a frog, heels together, press just in the home, but no lower. Press out into home and point the toes. What was that? No lower. No lower than home. Okay, now we're gonna roll up through our spine. So inner thighs tight, inhale here. Exhale, let's open up that lower back and roll all the way up. I'm gonna come by and put an extra spring on you guys as you're there. And when you're there, I want you to balance, bring the carriage all the way in, and not be on your neck. So check that you're on your scapula and you're bending here to keep you off your neck. It's okay? You got, let your feet go that way a little bit. There you go. <laughs> Bend your knees down. Good. And this is stretching the thoracic spine and the lower back. So you're going to feel it. This is thoracic and then lower back. And really round into it. Stretch. Keeping your knees bent, bring your feet down with you. Roll down one beautiful, opened, singing vertebrae at a time. Did that help, Nancy? It just hurts. Press out. I mean, I know it's helping, but... It hurts right now. <laughs> Take it. Oh, did you feel it? Take it up. Roll up. One vertebrae at a home. Uh, vertebrae at a time. Yes, yeah, your lower thoracic. Bend the knees down. Yeah, keep the knees bent. Stretching open your spine. Roll down. One vertebrae. Then the other vertebrae. Good, and feel that you're opening up and getting each one to move independently from the others. And then when your tailbone is down,
press out into home, turn zip and wrap, point the toes. Nice. Take it up again. Exhale all your air. Let your rib cage drop into your body. Let your carriage come into home. Bend the knees down, stretching through the thoracic spine. Breathe into your back and stretch. Hands are reaching, fingertips together, wrists are flat to open up those shoulders. Roll down one vertebrae at a time, knees bent. Good, we're gonna do three more, but you can take a break at any point you need to. Kirsten, how's your back with it? It's okay. Bending your knees, push down into home. Point those toes, good, core's on. So if I come and push on you, you won't go anywhere. Take it up. <laughs> you have a young, young spine. Bend down. You might come in. Young, young. <laughs> young, 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 young. Hold your feet right here. So we're changing it. Roll your spine down away from your feet. So now you're stretching out your hamstrings. Tailbone all the way down. And your goal is to get your tailbone down flat. Shoulders open. Hands reaching. Keeping your tailbone down. Don't lift, let it lift up. Bend the knees. Tailbone down and press out into home. Perfect, point the toes, long, long arches, squeeze those inner thighs, nice. And again, take it up, roll up, one vertebrae at a time, hands reaching, shoulders are down. Bend the knees down, stretch, good. Hold that stretch, look at your heels, don't let them move. Roll your spine away from your heels, straightening your legs. Nice, you guys. Stretch out those hamstrings. Tighten that pelvic floor and core. Bend the knees, but keep the tailbone down and press out into home. One more. Point the toes. Squeeze those inner thighs. Frankenstein bolts are on. Take it up. Roll up. One vertebrae at a time. Bend the knees down. Stretching. Good. Hold the feet still. <laughs> and from there, roll away from your feet. One vertebrae at a time. Straightening those legs, hands reaching, wrists are flat. That really helps in those shoulders. Good. From there, bend your knees, drop your tailbone even flatter, and press out into home. Perfect. Without moving the legs, bring your headrest up to high or middle. Let's go middle. You're it's perfect. Hands go into the small straps, and let's scoot down an inch and a half away from the shoulder rest. So kind of wiggle away from the shoulder rest. Mango's now eating from. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, the from, which one? Duck. Oh, okay. It's a purple one. Mango's my cat. Naomi's my dog. <laughs> and Naomi's eating from. And Naomi's loving from. And, and nay, nay. the gas. Better. Way better. Good. Yeah. As far as I know. I sell dog food and chicken feed and horse feed. Oh, really? Yeah. She's got the nursery. Who goes to nursery? Who goes to feed and nursery? From here, elbows come down. Near Pioneer. Across from runner storage. Yeah, knees, knees tight. 100. Knees tight. Follow them when in doubt, rest. Push your arms out. Hinge up as high as you can. Good. Your eye gaze is to your quads. You can push them out if your back's okay with it. And tap. Inhale for five. And exhale, two. Good. And in, out. Three, four, five, and exhale. Glutes are tight. And in, two, three, four, five, and exhale. Back's okay. And inhale. I know the machine's making noise. It's fine. You're doing fine. Good. Squeezing glutes. Hinge up a little higher. Yeah, rest your neck and take it down and just kind of shake it out and then come back into it. Shoulders down into the body as you hinge up. Two dynamics at the same time, the hinge and the shoulders down. Squeezing glutes. You look good. Drop and lift the legs ten times. Touch the bar and lift. Nancy, if it hurts your back, don't drop and touch the bar. Oh, touch unless it hurts your back. If it hurts your back, just drop your legs a little bit. How's your back? Good? Okay. Yeah, shoulders down. It is building that strength. Oh, baby. That's good. <laughs> 
No. Uh, two beds, one it's room. It's Monday, Kathy. It's Monday. Okay, from there, you can use your straps. Come up in the teaser. So watch Nancy do this one. Are we turning Uh-huh. And standing up like you own yeah. the machine. I'm not that strong. I'm really sorry. <laughs> it's usually a little bit prettier. Like <laughs> pretty pretty. <laughs> I'm not going to attempt it with, with the Uggs on, but um, yeah, when you step off the machine, it's kind of like, I own this, yeah. So from there, we're going to go a preloaded green spring, and they, they can go back on the long straps. After the preloaded green spring is on, take everything else off. We're going to drop the foot bar to flat. What was that? Um, yeah, we're going to go, let me go around this way. So the little bar goes up and around towards the carriage. The one place that the machine will bite uh -huh, is right here. So you never want to have your, like, put this here and, like, let go because it will it'll take a fingernail and, and bruise it badly. So we want here, and preload's up on this spot right there. And you double check it because it's your lifeline. And if it's not there, it's going to be really spooky. Yeah. And then these can go on. And so, Nancy, yours is right behind you on the chair. So the long part goes towards the carriage, and then we'll just righty tidy. These are little knobs. So these work for jump boards and for standing platforms. Yeah. And then it'll have some sponge to it, but it shouldn't collapse. So we always put pressure on it to make sure it's in. We'll drag our boxes out and we'll make them like step stools. Oh, my triceps were sore from when we did triceps on chair. Oh, good. Did I do the one on the floor where you sit on the floor? Yep. I did the three. Yeah. So using, using them as step stools. You're going to come up onto the machine facing Nancy's direction. And the foot's going to be about three inches in from the edge. So you're going to face this way. There you go. Does that sock feel slick at all? It's OK? OK. Look down at your feet and make sure that your heels are about between 9 and 12 inches apart. Arms go into I Dream a Genie. Stand up tall. Good. Marbles underneath your arches so you don't collapse your arches at all. Press out. Hold out. And tighten your glutes. Good. Hold for a count of five, four, three, two, one, and control. So automatically, I get a head rush. It, it goes right in my spine. This is Nancy's head rush forever. This, yeah, I like Press to out. do this with my arms. I have to do this. Wow. Sticky. That's so cool. Sticky. Good on my right. My left foot is sliding on the wood. Okay. Press out. Hold out. Hold for a count of five. Four, abs tight, three, two, one, and control up. So as our glutes are powerful and we push out, it tends to tilt us too much. And so we'll bow right here. So we want to slightly pull tail, not between the legs, but we're slightly pulling tail to keep disengaged here. Press out, hold out for a count of five. Breathing four, three, two, one, and control in. And again, press back out, hold out for a count of five, four, breathing three, two, one, and control. One more, press out, hold out for five, breathing four, three, keep breathing, two, one, and bring it in. We're going to go in and out, but even though the song is good, you still got to control it. So you're going to press out and then control the in for eight. When you control the in, you are the resistance to create the strength. This draws our hips together. I I just felt that the Michael Jackson station would be good and appropriate this morning. <laughs> so
Sink down into it. So hands go forward after your head rush. Booty back. And Good. Are we going with it or staying? We're going to stay to the left. So the left hip stays here. Abs are in. Create. Don't get short in your back. Create length in your back and press out and back in. Good. There you go. I should get a burn going here pretty soon. And you guys, sit bones tight. You feel burned? I can't feel it. Are you guys huh? feeling it? Yeah. Okay. That feeling? <laughs> we gotta get you. You have a really strong butt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's good to have back. Okay. So we're gonna step closer. <laughs> Slide that right foot in closer. If you guys are really feeling it, you don't have to though. Okay, now the machine wants to pitch you to the right, like this. So you have to stay between your heels, but we are gonna go with it. But you can't get over here because you're gonna end up in the mirror. <clears throat> so keep your tailbone between your heels to keep it safe. Yeah, really watch your balance on this one. <laughs> I keep thinking I'm gonna order sticky socks, have another you know, candy jar full of them. I need a secretary. <laughs> you need a sister. <laughs> I need an assistant and a secretary. I need someone to do all my book work because I hate it. Oh my God. I have the biggest head rush right now. I'm sorry. Like, you go out and find out my job, put it with you, and then I can There's a guy right now um, sending me emails to do marketing, but like Facebook, Twitter, and all that. I haven't talked to him yet. But we'll turn it around and we'll do the whole thing facing the front door. So look at your heels and instead of having nine inches, Kirsten, I'm going to have you step even closer to make it harder. Press out, hold out, I dream a genie. Yeah, go, yeah, straight leg goes, always go with it. Hold for a count of five, four, breathing, three, two, one, and control. Good, press back out, hold out, hold for a count of five, breathing four, three, two, one, and you control the end. No glutes yet, press out, there you go, hold for five, yeah, four, three, keep push for it, two, one, bring it in, press back out, hold, Good, hold for five, four, push on it, three, don't let it sink, two, one, bring it in, two more, press out, breathe. Good, lengthen the spine, hold for five, four, attitude, three, two, one, and in, press back out, hold for five, four, three, two, one, and you control the end. In and out for eight, but no riding. Like we, there is no we. Keep lifting that spine, creating airspace. Tighten that pelvic floor. Big Frankenstein bolts instead of on the sides of your neck and the sides of your glutes. All of a sudden the heater kicked on. It's not just because two of you are over the age of 40. Pelvic floor. Yeah. Try to like, squeeze. like you're, yeah, like you're Kegel. making it so you don't pee. <laughs> Pretend like you have to go potty really bad. And you, and you had a bad Mexican meal. <laughs> From here, bump the car door shut. Like you have a bag of groceries in your arms. Bump the car door shut and come straight down. Good. Push the left leg. Out and control in. Do you want two of them? Bring that foot in a little closer. Yeah. There, that's good. Get lower. Lower for the J Lo. There you go. 
after your eight, we're going to go with it for eight. Watching your balance. <laughs> we just, just put them all around you. But we're almost done. Get low, low for the J-Lo. It's you and me together. Short box goes on. Good morning. Oh, how are you? Good. Oh, Princess is here. It was going off the whole time. I gotta go. Okay, you're good. Do all, um, yeah, platform comes off. I got it. Just take off. You're welcome. Okay, see you Wednesday. Let me know. I can do Wednesday. Uh, from here, the standing platforms come off. This goes on top of the chair. Oh. Then take your gear bar back according to your height or your length of legs. Oh, bring the, yeah, bring the bar up. Okay, sitting up on top, hook your feet. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye, Kristen. So, with a strap being longer, you gotta scoot back long further. Is she great? Her husband's done all of my um, sound system. Aaron, Aaron Renner is awesome. Um, Mountain Home Sound and Security. She's a Renner. Oh, I didn't know that. She's the photographer. Oh. I know, very talented. Lift and lengthen, squeeze and lift straight back. I thought she was going to No. Hold here, <laughs> narrow the pelvis, hold for five and four. And three, two, one, and come up. How's she doing with her new stuff? Good. Lean back. Hold back. Good. Shoulders down. Squeeze your glutes. Lift another two inches out of that pelvis. Pull those hips tight. Good. Three, two, one, and come up. Good. Inhale here. And again, lean back. She's so sweet. Good, narrow the pelvis, hold for five, four, breathing, three, two, one, come up nice and tall. Good, hold here, take it all the way to the left in that toaster slot, don't lean back. This is tall, and back, and take it over. Is she daughter or daughter-in-law? Daughter-in-law. Daughter-in-law. Yeah, he's Aaron Renner. Okay. And nice and tall, and over. She's an absolute artist. Yeah. Oh, and over. I do. Just. Oh, okay. If she can't do it, um, she'll know someone that's as good a quality. The other one's Doug Chafin, but he's now so good, he's very, very, very expensive. Yeah. And bring it up. We're going to change it. Take it, tilt it to the left. Actually, bring it back up, sorry. Twist to the left. And lean. And come up and back to the front. And twist. And lean. And come up and back to the front. Good. And again, twist. And lean. And up and back to the front. And over and lean, and up, and back to the front. How's your back feeling? It's tight. I was just thinking that I think reformers the best thing when you have a sore back. It does open everything up. We're going to do mermaid, but I really want you to curl. Yeah. 
You could even just go into the hawk stretch. Okay. So we're going to be on the left hip. And the left leg will curl under the other leg. Hip on top of hip. Hand goes up. Good. Shoulders down. Go up and over. So to keep it out of that thoracic spine, draw the rib cage in deeper and pull tail. And use it almost as a stretch, even if you have to use your hand. Good. Now as you do this, keep that right hip still. We're doing 12, but the right hip never moves. What's that? What's mine trying to do? It's just it was shifting a little bit back. So think about pulling it towards you as you come up. There you go. That make it harder? Just like that. 12. It's on how you say it. 12. It's better than saying 11. And switch to the other side. Straighten the left leg as much as you can. You're on the right hip. That help with the stretch? Yeah. There you go. Good. Keeping that hip there. Pull tail between the legs even more. Yeah. Rib cage backing in. Good. Oh, I can feel it all. All yeah. through. Take it deeper then. Like focus on really getting this IT. Is that okay? How are we doing, Kathy? Good. Sorry, Kathy. You're no, no. On this one. I'm glad I could do this. I'm sorry, you're right. I'm glad I came, though, because yes. I knew it was reformer and it would help rather than just letting it be sore. Yeah. You know I mean? Right. And you know, your IT bands are in really good shape. Are they? Most people would go through the ceiling if I did this to them. Really? Yes, yeah, so your ITs are your ITs are awesome. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah, I put my knuckles in the most people's IT bands. They hit the ceiling. Whoa! Okay. Says I have awesome ITs. <laughs> You're gonna strut those today. Look at my right. ITs. Okay, bring the gear bars in. Once the gear bars are in, boxes go under, and we'll go into stretching. We're gonna use elephant to stretch first. So two red springs. Okay, bar, foot bars in middle. And we're going to be standing with our heels against the shoulder rest. Heels down, toes up, straight legs, hands on bar. Put a lock on. Yep. Okay, now look at your feet. And you know that if you normally pronate, let's supinate. And if you normally supinate, let's pronate. And if you're stretching out, your fascia, go ahead and pronate. What's the stretch. pronate is that? What's, pro, what's the difference? Soup is like you're holding a bowl of soup. So this would be supinating, holding a bowl of soup. Pronating is this way. Okay. Are my shoulders over my hands or my back? Your back. So your tailbone's behind your heels. Uh, Press it. out and in. And Kathy, you can even take those feet and go from the inside to the outside till you feel a really good stretch. Ten of these. Does Zena have a dog visitor? She does. Oh, she is? Oh. Oh, so you're going to have three. I am. Bless you. Yeah. Bless you. She's a good girl. Like Xena. <laughs> Unless your brother comes around and then she's the boss. <laughs> yeah, she's training him. Yeah, Xena's the boss. Yeah. in training to be the best dog ever. From their knees come down. We're going to go down to one red spring. Take your left foot forward onto the standing platform. Holding your left shin there, push your right knee back and curl those toes under on the right side. Hold your hips down towards the springs. Good morning. 
How are you, Jen? <laughs> That's another story. <laughs> Straighten the left leg. Good to see you. Deep, 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 deep stretch. Left knee comes in, right knee goes back. Good. And again, press all the way out. Cold floor? Cold floor, yeah. Bend that left knee to come in. Okay, Kathy, this one's for you. Don't fall off the machine. This is the only time I've ever fallen off the machine. So you both can do it, but I just want you to watch your balance. Your left foot is going to come to this side of the bar. Good. Like the toes? Yeah, toes on. Press out. We're going to switch out those ITs, not that you need it. Hold on somewhere. Sure. <laughs> yes. Press out. Good. So see how it's stretching out that foot? And then from there, you're going to bend your right knee in. You feel the IT stretching here? And press back out. Yeah. Bend the knee. Bend the right knee. And press back out. Can you go straight with this leg? Okay. Just go where you can. These are cool. Like whoopee. Soft. Good. In and out for A. And then we'll switch legs. So this is my theory with fasciitis and tendonitis is hormones. Yeah, it started after menopause. It's all, if you look at, I've been studying about my frozen shoulder, that's no longer frozen. <laughs> and uh, it's testosterone. Well, Press off. Get some good stuff and get some <laughs> Push the left knee back. Hi, Sarah. Oh, just start with the regular one right here. Oh, that's right. Did you get any snowboarding in on? Okay. Push all the way out. Just sink the hips. Even lower. Clearly, I'm a little more flexible on this side than my other side. It's that hip, that left hip. Bend in. Good morning, Nita. Good, press back out, sink low, and bend back in, good, pull torso, then take the right foot, don't lose your balance, take it up, definitely hold on, take your time with this so you don't fall over. Now keep the right leg straight and bend the left knee. Right. There you go. Thank you. You're welcome. That's why you guys need me here. That's right. Otherwise, you can just stick a cardboard figure. <laughs> That'd be so great. That'd be sad. <laughs> a bobblehead. <laughs> Every so often, it goes one beautiful vertebrae at a time. <laughs> <laughs> Shoulders down. Attitude. Pelvic floor. Frankenstein bolts. Shoulders down. Shoulders down. Shoulders down. Chin floats. <laughs> yeah. Chin floats. And now it's open neck, open throat. After eight of those, we'll step down towards the front door. Ah, oh, I feel better already. Lace fingertips back behind you. What did you forget? Oh, there's a whole, there's a whole drawer. <laughs> oh, you smell so good, too. Oh, it smells great. And over. Good. Inhale, bring as much air as you can in. Three puffs in. Exhale, press all the air out. And again, inhale, three puffs in, 
Exhale, press all the air out. Good. One small jump. One big jump. You guys are done. Happy Monday. Say goodbye to everybody at home. Bye, Bye guys. Bye.